is uh, taking to the top. Powell, it's made it almost impossible for Anderson. They come at him, and the captain of the Hawks, Dillamore, wraps him up. Oh, he's gone. By circling. Gone. So Dillamore, in his struts, won't be his first goal, but it'll be his first captain's goal. For the first time in seven weeks, as they build again, the Hawks, Nash, centering, Lewis, right spot. Hands of glue, Mitch Lewis. The key forward. It's the perfect kick, and he's looking for the perfect night. He pulls the kick at the last minute. Lockie Bramble, he saw it. it might have been Meek. Bramble's going to pump it to the contest with a big fly, Lewis! Lewis with the sit. Bit of clearance down the spine. Lukosh just pushed under it a little. Hits the deck. King. This is a huge kick. Ainsworth around his body. Delivers on cue. Harwick. Bang! Big hard heavy shoulder by Mook, who wasn't Mook at all. Went right at him. Put him on his backside. Ballard goes wide. Saying that it's more his ribs, because his ribs are completely open there. You can see the full leg and body go through his ribs as well. Every single time he's out there, he'll work and work and work. As they go forward, it might be a free kick here for Lukosius. Well, he's gone close a few times, got his hands close to the Sharon. Bruce steps inside of Powell and then dabs it up, but that's uh, easy for those long, long arms of MacAndrew. So, probably in good hands. Ainsworth centers it anyway. Ritz! Big, strong grab. So they've gone with Hasbold again, and Scrimshaw caught here. And I said that wasn't a handball. Got plenty on it, but Andrew went and got it. Gave to Holman. Back inside, 50, and the mark taken by Day saves the day. Here goes Impy. Is it a better kick this time? Collins out marks Reeves. Will Day, the South Australian. Not too much on offer, so he goes towards the ruck at MacAndrew. What about that? Ball in, Wits. Amon beats the handball inside to Warple. Andrew stalking it again, and he's up again with that chest. Big chest mark. It's not a huge chest, but he's using it well. Saw Day playing across half-back loose, but they put him back into the midfield to try and win this thing. To Newcomb. Heads long. Andrew has been marking everything, which is a good sign. Ainsworth to a two-on-two, two, needed to be precise. Again, Kaspolt drops it at the last minute. Pouncing on it was Amon, and he's been able to hit up a target in Bruce. There's the 30-metre pass, just waited out in front of... Yep. Yep. He's not keen to have a shot. Oh. No, eight goals, 11 this season, so he goes with a spear pass to King. Speaking of reliable, he's been ultra-reliable. For the instant reply for the Suns. Gets it through. Fiorini to centre half forward. Is a chance for Casbolt. Hasn't been his day just yet. Lacocious. Beautiful pass. A bullet like pass. And he had the finishing touches. Get the mark out by 16 points. And if we can't start moving the ball better, we're going to have to get some more run into the game. Flick off to Holman. He's got the one-on-one, -on -one. Lukosius with a ribbon on it. Sam Mitchell has moved from the coach's box. Down to the bench, here's a chance. Anderson advantage, route. Advantage. advantage played, and Swallow gets involved in the action. The veteran. Sprays it. Not a lot of players there to help Casbolt out on the goal line. Frost, Swallow. Casbolt, Holman, the cavalry arrives, and a Holman delivers. Mackenzie, Day, got a paddock. Goes long. Bruce in front, too strong. It's experience against Ben Long. So Will Day, can he hit a target inside 50? Here he is again. McPherson on cue. And sitting underneath, that was Scrimshaw. Inside kick, looking for Warple, but 
Outpointed by the best intercept mark in the comp, Bella. Second crack stolen by Humphrey. He creates oh. things, does Bailey Humphrey, going back bravely with Swallow. Met heavily, it pops out. Here's Roses. Four by rounds. Here's a chance for Roses. Under the pump here is uh, Mitchell, the youngster. He overruns it and Roses toe pokes it through. Take that, Sam Kerr. What about that for inspiration? I love the Roses celebration as well. Jump in the air and a little bit of celebration. They're not done yet. Fiorini bangs it inside 50. A little nudge. Jace okay, Hardwick is not happy. Oh, it's going to go the way of Roses. He's got a real smell about it now, hasn't he? He's kicked three in the final turn. Stiff arm push off. Gets it back for his trouble. And normally better than that. Collins is a hard man to beat. Sam Collins. Suns have just been all over them since quarter time. Atkins the sub. Straight down the corridor. Anderson. From 52 out. Has it got the carry? It does. Roses. Not for his fourth. Ainsworth. Unselfish it was. King's called for it and he's got it. Including... His two goals. What is it now? Two for the night. That's been a success story. Back at home for the first time in two months and back on the winner's list. The Gold Coast Suns are within touching distance of the top eight with nine games to go. And that by curse has bitten the horse. Noah Anderson, uh, you must be wrapped with that. That was a really convincing win after what would have been a tough week. Yeah, 100%. Obviously, a really disappointing result for us last week. So, really happy with the week we had. Um, review went well, and we really focused in on a few things we delivered tonight, which is really satisfying. It was slow out of the blocks the first 15 minutes. Obviously, Hawthorne come off a, a really good win last start. Yeah. But what turned things around from essentially quarter time? Um, we simplified our footy a little bit. We thought we were overusing it a little bit. In these conditions, we just tried to get it forward, and our forwards are doing a really good job at competing and halving the contest and kicking snags. So, um, yeah, that was good. That worked for us. You said you reviewed it pretty, pretty hard from last week. The crosshairs were on the midfield. How do you take it, and what do you feel you had to change personally from uh, to get into a really high standard this week? Yeah, obviously, it was really disappointing um, last week, and we all took it as a collective unit. So, um, a few little things. We got killed at centre bounce last week, so... We timed up a few things there tonight. I think the numbers will show we um, we improved in that area tonight. So um, credit to the team, and it was a weighted numbers performance, which is really pleasing.